one of WA's biggest companies, has hit out at the McGowan government over Christmas shopping hours. The boss of Bunnings, Kmart and Target says the laws are driving customers online and hurting local businesses. Bunnings is a WA institution, its parent company one of our state's biggest. But when it comes to our unique shopping laws, West Farmers boss Rob Scott says WA is behind the times. I'm a very parochial Western Australian and I would really like to see our stores and our workers get a fair go. The CEO going public after the McGowan government cut back Christmas trading this year. Just 34 extra hours are on offer. Many retailers won't be able to open their doors earlier at 7am until just one week before Christmas. Sales are going to go elsewhere to the east coast and online because our shops won't be open. And Bunnings wants to go further and scrap restrictions on what shops can sell. The rules are strict. To open at 7am on Sunday, Bunnings is allowed to sell light bulbs but not light fixtures. Outdoor and flat pack furniture but not indoor furniture. Kitchen sinks but not white goods like dishwashers. Coles bottle shops can also sell wine from 10am. But if you want milk, you'll have to wait until 11 when the supermarket's finally allowed to open. Open. Now this is incredibly confusing for customers when they come into our stores and when they shop online they don't have those kind of restrictions. And it's not just big businesses like Bunnings affected. Caravans can be sold any time but motorhomes are banned from one o'clock on a Saturday and on Sundays forget about selling them at all. Well we've got to close them, lock them up. Can't go in the doors, um, you know, everything else can be open, the caravans and whatnot, but you just can't open your motorhomes. A top of the range motorhome like this one comes with a price tag of around $200,000 and if the customer can't walk through it, it's a no sale. The Premier says he'll look at restrictions in the lead up to the next election. As for this Christmas... I don't think a lot of people are upset if in early December there's not an extension from 8 till 7 in the morning. Uh, it just seems to me to be a pretty minor thing. Grace Fitzgibbon, Nine News.